misguided. The British tabloids appear to be out for revenge against a Canadian disc jockey who tricked the Queen into an on-air phone call about Quebec independence. Pierre Broussard pretended to be the Canadian Prime Minister for 17 minutes last week, and he convinced the Queen to speak with him. One tabloid gave out Broussard's phone number and invited readers to call him. Another tabloid tricked Broussard into thinking it would treat him by paying him for his exclusive story. When News Channel 3 News at 11 returns, Ray Williams joins us with all the Redskins' Giants action. And it was a big day for a local NASCAR driver. Sports next. Stay with us. So, with all this new technology, where do you go from here? Anywhere you want. See your Hampton Roads Jeep and Eagle dealer. Police play chicken with a carload of drive-by shooters. Right at us. On the next Cops. Monday at 7 on New Channel 3. Parents who spy on their children on the next Gabrielle. Well, a number of sports fans were had the sniffles today, and it wasn't because they had a cold. That's right. If they were Redskin fans, well, it was kind of a sad night. Well, anyway, the Washington Redskins played host to the New York Giants tonight. The Skins haven't beat the Giants since Dan Reeves took over the team several years ago. We go now to RFK for a moment. Turning now to NASCAR, it was a great day for a driver, Ricky Rudd. The Chesapeake native won the Dura Lube 500 in Arizona, 1983. We go now to the standings. Ricky Rudd, as I said, uh, was in first, pla pla first place. Derek Cope was in second. Dale Earnhardt was in third place. Rusty Wallace fourth. And Jeff Gordon was in fifth place. Now on now to the Winston Cup point totals. Je uh, Jeff Gordon did not clinch the title tonight. So uh, we'll have to go to the final day of racing coming up. Uh, Dale Earnhardt was in second. Mark Martin was in third. Sterling Marlin was in fourth place. And Rusty Wallace is in fifth place. Well, in other racing news, a stark car driver was killed today during a modified race at the Mid-Atlantic 500 Championships in Asheboro, North Carolina. Racing officials say 39-year-old Kenny Manter of Martinsville died when his car bumped another, causing him to crash into the wall at the Caraway Speedway. The driver of the other car was not injured. Now back to the NFL. It was prime time in Atlanta today. Neon Deion Sanders made his debut with the Dallas Cowboys and what better way to start with a new team by playing his old team, the Atlanta Falcons. 26 now on to the scoreboard. The Colts uh, won over the Jets. The Lions beat the Packers. The Dolphins beat the Bills. In overtime, it was the Cardinals over the Seahawks. And the 49ers were upset by the New Orleans Saints. The Bucks lost to the Oilers, and the Monday night matchup is the Bears and the Vikings. And that's about it. That's all we got for sports tonight. All right. And I don't think that was enough, Ray. Thanks. <laughs> you know, walking is generally regarded as a sport, but, or isn't really, unless some people think so. But today along the oceanfront, walking turned into a major league event. Thousands participated in the Healthy Choice Heart Walk today. Participants included teams from more than... 200 companies and organizations locally. By the end of the day, they had raised around $75,000 for the war on heart disease and stroke. By the way, our own Tom Randalls was out there to lend his support. Meantime, area youngsters were burning off that extra energy in their usual fashion. <laughs> yes, they were involved in some serious play. So what's new? The playground. It's opening day for Imagination Island at Northside Community Park in Norfolk. The quarter of a million dollar project was built by volunteers with donated funds. And it appears to be a major hit with the folks who will use it the most. Coming up next on News Channel 3 News at 11, it's strange to be sure, but it should leave you smiling. Sometimes it's good to take some off the top. So Toyota dealers will take up to $750 off a 95 Surcel Deluxe with an options discount. And more with a $500 rebate. And if you act now, you could save up to $1,250 in factory to dealer incentives. And your Toyota dealer might take off even more to make you a very attractive deal. So this is a great time to take off in a new Tercel. It's a Halloween to remember at the Taylor House of Horrors. Tonight on WTKR News Channel 3. We all know that Halloween is not until Tuesday night, but that only applies to humans. Because today was 
Dogoween at the Ample Hill Mall in Kalamazoo, Michigan. Oh sure, a number of humans were on hand, but this event had gone to the dogs in their costumes. Poochahontas was a favorite, <laughs> and so was the dog and the frog outfit. This looks like it has all the makings of a, a beer commercial. It's like fun. Well, that's it for News Channel 3 News at 11, so thanks for watching. News continues, though, at 5.30 tomorrow morning with Kurt Williams and Ann Keffer. Have a good night and a good week. Closed captioning provided by Trigon Blue Cross Blue Shield, the healthcare company of choice. Room. Automatic nightlights can guide you to exits if you're sleeping. Provide rope ladders on upper levels if there is no fire escape. Be prepared and increase your family's chance of survival. This message brought to you by Home Quarters Warehouse. It's HQ to the rescue. Home Improvement will be right back after these messages. Hi, folks. How you doing? Wouldn't you like to take a vacation from all of this? Come on, come with us. Amtrak's new Northeast Direct. We go up and down the East Coast. Philadelphia. When you arrive here, you're in the middle of everything. Boston. Nice station, huh, Sue? You don't have to pack your car. Union Station, Washington. The first time I came in this station, it took my breath away. When you arrive, you're in the center of it all. Wow. Wouldn't you rather be in one of our cars? Johnny Bench for S&K's Double Play Sale. Why shop the department stores when S&K has thousands of suits on sale? Right now you can take home two S&K suits for less than you'd expect to pay for one department store suit. These are great looking wool blend suits you can wear year round. And you get two for under 200 bucks. So pick up your next Double Play at S&K. Because if you go to a department store, you're going to strike out. Nine area locations in the peninsula. Chesapeake, Norfolk, Virginia Beach, and Williamsburg. As Halloween approaches, you have to prepare yourself for what might happen. More orange sprinkles. It's a special time of year, and Dunkin' Donuts is dressing up their donuts for the occasion. And here's the werewolf. So come to Dunkin' Donuts and get into the spirit of Halloween. We'd like some Halloween donuts, please. Oh, of course. <laughs> Don't change your channel. Home Improvement will be right back. On the next episode of Seinfeld. I never knew you were so into breasts. I thought you were a leg man. A leg man? Why would I be a leg man? I don't need legs. I have legs. Monday at 4.30 on News Channel 3. EKR News Channel 3. Proud to serve Moyoc, Currituck County, Elizabeth City. We're proud to serve you from Northeast North Carolina. I just moved into the city, right? And I need a really flexible car. So I lease a Volkswagen Golf. $1.99 a month. It's great. I sell cappuccino machines. Sometimes I need to move big things. Sometimes I have to move little things, but I always have to move. It's got dual airbags, daytime running lights, and everything fits into it. And it fits into everything. Hey! I have got to cut back on the caffeine. On the road of life, there are passengers and there are drivers. Keeping kids safe this Halloween, Monday on WTKR News Channel 3. An elite circle of nannies who know all the biggest stars' dirty little secrets. Nannies are really treated like one of the family. They watch the kids, see everything, and now break their silence. It's the secrets of Hollywood nannies. Then, Antonio Banderas. We travel to Spain in search of this Spanish Romeo's roots. From the exclusive photos of his youth to his family's reaction to Melanie, it's growing up Antonio. Plus, hot hunks who mix brains with beefcake on hot coffee. Monday at 4 on News Channel 3. When Felix threatened Hampton Roads, we experienced firsthand the importance of hurricane preparedness. I'm News Channel 3's meteorologist, Dr. Duane Hardy. It's hurricane season, and that means it's time for WTKR News Channel 3 hurricane tracking charts. Inside, you'll find valuable safety tips, trivia, names of future storms, and a chart to plot coordinates I'll provide on News Channel 3 weathercasts. Pick yours up today at your local Chrysler Plymouth dealer.
from. <laughs> Anger, pain, misery, shame. Is mom to blame? Next, Geraldo. Parents who spy on their children. I learned how to spy because of her. Sure, the world's a dangerous place, but is spying the best way to keep kids safe? I just like to double check here from time to time. There's times where we listen to conversations. Meet some teens who've had enough. Mm -hmm. She put me in four mental hospitals. Do you know stuff that I, I just haven't told them? Breaking the case of the spying parents. I waited a while and followed them to make sure that's where he went. On the next Gabrielle. Monday at 10 on News Channel 3. The tricks on Tim, the treats on you. Monday on WTKR News Channel 3. This is an emergency room, a place for doctors, nurses, and injured people, but not a place for lawyers. Soliciting clients here is against the lawyer's code of ethics. Unfortunately, a few lawyers don't follow the rules, and that's bad for all of us. If you're solicited by a lawyer in an emergency room, don't talk to them. There's a time and a place for a lawyer, and this isn't it. Bright Dresher and Bright. Bright Dresher and Bright. Bright Dresher and Bright. They're lawyers who know how to win.